Today, we're seeing some anime where the main character goes to heaven. Here are the 10 romance anime where the guy gets laid. Let's go. Number 10, Paradise Kiss. To start off this list, we have to ask the question, what would you do if a dude who looks like he could kill you starts looking at you weirdly? I would just run away, and that was what our girl Yukari exactly did. But she just straight up falls unconscious after she meets another weird lady. That's when she realizes they're actually fashion designers, and their head designer isn't going to stop until Yukari becomes their model. I first have to say that the plot of this anime is really unique, especially in how the characters interact. In just 12 episodes, they give you everything you need and more. I was actually impressed at how funny and dramatic it can be at the same time, and of course, they do the deed. It's an underrated anime that I wish more people would watch. Number 9, Fruits of Griseya. <laughs> There's one person that's probably the luckiest man on earth, and it's our boy Yuji. He enrolled in Mihama Academy, and it turns out there are just six other girls that are his classmates. Because the group is so small, they learn more about each other, including their traumas and real personalities. And in the middle of all this is Yuji, where he tries to save each one of them, which leads from one challenge to another. You could really tell that the fruits of Grisea came from a light novel. The way the story was written, the pacing, the main conflict really have that style. It also doesn't shy away from throwing dark and realistic issues that uh, make you feel uncomfortable sometimes. It's a perfect mix of a cringy harem anime and a deep dramatic series that is quite rare to see. Number 8, Rumbling Hearts. You can really tell that this was made in the early 2000s just by how sharp their jawlines are and how big their eyes are. Rumbling Hearts follows the story of Haruka, who became a couple with her crush Takayuki. Everything was sunshine and rainbows until someone was sent up into a coma, and when they woke up, they might just ruin everyone's relationships. Yep, I won't reveal who it is, so go and watch the anime. Even though Rumbling Hearts is old, that doesn't mean it's not good. Even though you're not a fan of romance anime, this one particular series might just enter your top 10. I mean, it does look generic and redundant in the start, but once that particular scene happens, it'll blow your mind away. You should keep going because after episode 3, things get spicy. And the story will make you addicted to it. Number 7, White Album 2. <laughs> Sound of Destiny is still not yet done. What are you doing? You can do it. I'll show you everything. Okay, it does involve music, but it wasn't made by Taylor Swift. White Album 2 is all about Haruki Kitahara and his about to be disbanded light music club. White Album 2 is like a sad k -on because when Haruki was playing White Album, he heard the voice of an angel that would save their entire club, as well as give him the chance to have a performance that would change his entire life. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I'm actually shocked at how underrated this anime is. Even if the guy did do the dirty, the anime didn't become trashy. The characters are so relatable that I promise you that you'll be able to connect with at least one of them. It portrays love in one of the most realistic and beautiful ways I've seen in anime, and I think the emotions might be on par with series like Violet Evergarden. Number 6, F, A Tale of Memories. 
ありがとう。何か。心配してくれてありがとう。な何言ってんだよ。Okay, so stick with me here because things might get really confusing. First, there's Hiro who gets into a relationship with Miyako after she wrecks his bike, and this makes Kai jealous. Then, a photographer named Kayosuke starts noticing Kai. After that, Renji wants to become a girl's hero, and that's when he meets Kai's twin and they write a novel together. All of these relationships will one day come together, and heartbreaks will start to happen. <laughs> どんな時でも私だけ見ててくれる。あ、私はもう。Yep, this has so many characters and relationships that it looks like it's the Avengers Endgame of Romance anime. But even though it may seem like it doesn't make sense, they actually wrap it up into one amazing series. It's hard to make one love story work, but F manages to make several so impactful. It'll blow your expectations away, so give it a shot. Number five, Wreck. <laughs> Make sure that when you search r e c on Google, you add the word anime because、uh, you might just mistakenly watch a Spanish horror film. In the r e c anime, Fumihiko got up on a movie date only for a random girl to come with him instead, which turns out to be Aka Onada. And they live in the same neighborhood, but Aka's place burns to the ground, so she lives in his place. This is when his entire life will turn upside down. さあ、冷えないうちに寝ちゃいな。ストーブもつけたしな。優しくしないで。For something released in 2006, the art style totally surprised me by how good it is. It was a cute and wholesome show, but that's until you realize the guy gets laid. I know, right? No one expects this one to have that, and it actually has a lot of similarities with F since they're made by the same studio. Number four, banished from the hero's party, I decided to live a quiet life in the countryside. From the title alone, you already know that the MC went through, but this wasn't a punishment because my man scored with how beautiful the female lead is. He secretly lives as Red, and no one knows he's the brother of the hero. Even though he just wants to live a peaceful life, his past as a hero will come back to cause some trouble once again, and he might not be able to run away from them. <laughs> From the character relationships to how they interact, this series does an amazing job of making what seems to be a boring story into something interesting. We always see the hero defeating the Demon King, but we rarely get to see what happens to the members of the hero's party after they manage to win. Might sound like a wholesome slice of life, but it does a great job of balancing good writing with mystery and action. Number three, his and her circumstances. <laughs> You might think that this is just another high school romance anime, but it wouldn't be on this list if it didn't include the good old bed scenes. Yukino was the perfect student, being good at almost everything, even making friends. That was until her rival arrived, but she successfully beat him. Well, that was until he found something to blackmail her with, and now Yukino became his errand girl. あえ,えっとごめん頭冷やしてくる。One thing you might notice is that the opening and ending scenes are bangers. The animation might be sometimes inconsistent, but the plot makes up for it. A lot of things that happen here are quite original, and you usually won't see them in other anime. It might be a hit or miss for all the viewers out there, but once you push past its flaws, you'll see that it's one of the best romance shows there is. Number two, we were there. うまいだろ。
I was also there. I was there when no one realized that this was a great show and no one was talking about it. Follows the story of our girl Nanami Takahashi where she meets our boy Yanu Motoharu but they actually have a past that might cause some trouble. Even though Yano once dated her sister, they started a relationship. Everything was okay until her older sister got into an accident and things might change for the worse. The main conflict in this series might be more complex than what you see in other anime shows. You also have to know that the way they handled their situations were also realistic because you don't really move on easily. The animation is simple and straightforward, which sometimes even enhances the drama that happens. Just give it a try and you'll see what I'm talking about. Number one, Scum's Wish. <laughs> Yes, this is your wish because you are a scum. Our boy Mugi is in a relationship with Hanabi, but in actuality, they aren't really in love. Hanabi wants her childhood friend while Mugi loves Akane, but the ones they like aren't actually in love with them. So that they won't be lonely and feel the pain, both Mugi and Hanabi decided that they'll use each other as comfort and that's when the bed scenes start. It's actually relatable to see characters not get what they want. Everything that happens here is unusual and pretty strange for the romance anime genre. A lot of people actually rate it a 10 out of 10 because it shows us the ugly side of love we never get to see. From the animation to the story to the character writing, Scum's Wish nails it all. And that's why it's number one in our list of the top 10 romance anime where the guy gets laid.